Good morning everybody and it's Monday, so start of a new week and we think this might be week 11 of lockdown, although we're not so sure. So a uh, not very pleasant week for the weather, a weekend for the weather, but this week coming ahead I think the days have to get better as we go along. So it's always it seems a wee bit better when the weather's bright and at least we can look out and feel a wee bit happy about something. So Thursday um, is the day when I'm going to be taking up golf and bowling because Nicola has said that I can do those things after Thursday. Um, I couldn't do them before Thursday but I think after Thursday I'm going to take up bowling and golf if nothing else so that we can get out and do something. Um, I'm only joking by the way so don't worry all the bowling ladies um, are not coming to beat you all this week but I'm sure there will be some people really pleased to hear that they can um, start doing some things again with all the correct social distancing in place. Um, we didn't do much over the weekend ourselves, um, the weather kind of kept us in a bit so we did manage to get some things up into the loft and um, we did manage to catch up with some people and um, we'll catch up with a few others during this week so hope everybody's doing fine and remember we're always here if you need us just give us a wee call. Um, on a Sunday night the Church of Scotland have been um, asking for everyone to join in prayer at seven o'clock every Sunday evening and last night the new moderator Martin Fair he um, gave this Bible reading for people to think about so I'm going to just stick with Martin and it's John chapter 17 and it's entitled Jesus prays for his disciples. After Jesus finished saying this he looked up to heaven and said Father the hour has come give glory to your son so that the son may give glory to you for you gave him authority over all people so that he might give eternal life to all those you gave him. And eternal life means to know you, the only true God, and to know Jesus Christ, whom you sent. I have shown your glory on earth. I have finished the work you gave me to do. Father, give me glory in your presence now, the same glory I had with you before the world was made. I have made you known to those you gave me out of the world. They belonged to you and you gave them to me. They have obeyed your word and now they know that everything you gave me comes from you. Gave them the message that you gave me and they received it. They know that it is true that I came from you and they believe that you sent me. I pray for them. I do not pray for the world but those for those you gave me for they belong to you. All I have is yours and all you have is mine and my glory is shown through them. And now I am coming to you. I am no longer in the world, but they are in the world. Holy Father, keep them safe by the power of your name, the name you gave me, so that they may be the one just as you and I are one. Amen. God bless this reading from his holy word. Um, on Friday also, um, I uh, participated in a webinar with the Church of Scotland and uh, I think that there were a thousand people in the, in the webinar and uh, the Church of Scotland trustees were kind of mapping out some of the way ahead for the church in Scotland. So it's now on the Church of Scotland website. You can have a look at it there and listen to as much or as little of it as you wish. It did last for an hour and a half, but you can um, have a look there. And uh, it was led by the moderator, Martin Fair, and um, trustees and Dave Kendall from our own church um, did speak about what they see as the way ahead for the Church of Scotland so very interesting if you have got some time and you can go on to the Church of Scotland website then you'll find that there that you can have a wee look at um, from it was there from Saturday so so you can have a look there so lots of things on our own Facebook pages lots of things on our own website have a look 
um, and uh, catch up with what's been happening with the church. So have a good day today. Nice sunny at the minute. Um, get outside, get some vitamin D, not vitamin C. Vitamin C! Yeah. As we had with a quiz question, which we got wrong, um, get some good vitamins from the sun, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Bye.